Hey, I'm Shane from PDQ.com. All right, our first video, we walked you through uh, creating uh, an installation file using the OCT or the Office Customization Toolkit for Microsoft Office. Um, now we've built that, if you recall, we have our MSP file out there that was created, that we've generated, it creates all the, all the options, which components you want installed, et cetera, for Office. Now we're gonna use PDQ Deploy to deploy that. So uh, I've created a, a package in PDQ Deploy. Notice I've got two install steps. To create an install step, you simply go to new step, hit install, and I have an install step per architecture. So that means I used, I'd created two different uh, Office customization uh, files in the OCT. And the install file, notice I'm using a file server, just the path to that setup.exe. This is the 32-bit version, so in conditions, I set the, old, the appropriate OS versions since it only works with 7, 8.1, and 10. Uh, and then we're, we're saying only deploy this to 32-bit architecture. And then I'll also, you know, the 64-bit step, we're saying only on 64-bit versions of, uh, of these windows. And it's pointing to a, a different setup.exe in the 64-bit folder. Now, very important, the parameters. If you recall, we instantiated the uh, OCT by uh, going to start run and we did a slash admin to to open up the OCT to customize it here you've already done that we want to have the parameter be slash admin file space and the name of the file that's why it's important that that file exists in the same directory as the setup.exe so uh, slash admin file there's our 64-bit MSP file and then obviously the 32-bit uh, step has points to the corresponding 32-bit MSP. Very important, you need to include entire directory here. Um, if you don't do that, the setup will hang. You need to copy all those files down to the target. Now, since I am, this is a very, very um, uh, intensive installation. I mean, you can see it's two gigabytes worth of data. Uh, and I'm pulling this off a of file server. The reason I'm mentioning that is it's important in these cases, you go to properties, and under options, change your copy mode if you are pulling the, going off of a file share or remote file share. Set your copy mode to pull because uh, that way, it, you know, all we're doing is going out to each target saying, hey, go out to this file share and grab all those files and copy them down. If you use the push, it's your console that's going out, grabbing those files, bringing it down to the console and then pushing it out to all the targets. So it's actually doubling your bandwidth requirements. So we are setting our copy mode to pull once again. And that's, that's very simple. I mean, that now that we've got this uh, set up to push this out, remember we had built this saying, when we built the OCT, deploy this silently. Now it's, a, it's very simple. Just select your file, go to deploy, choose your targets that you want, uh, or you can just obviously you know type, type them in. We'll just do a, a couple of files. You can choose targets from Active Directory, from PDQ Inventory, uh, Spiceworks, it doesn't matter, but we'll make this you know, somewhat, somewhat easy here. Just a couple of computers and then hit deploy once you're all ready to go. And of course you can also schedule this, et cetera, et cetera. And now it's telling those, these, two, these two computers, copy those files down, start that deployment. Um, it could take a while, you know, usually, in our network, we're usually seeing around 10 minutes for an installation. Um, if it starts to take, if it takes longer than 45 minutes to an hour and you have a fairly fast network, then you're going to want to do some digging and see if, um, you know, you entered the correct license code for the product, etc. Uh, otherwise, it could just hang. So count on some time for uh, getting it out there, but this is a very, very effective method of deploying your software. If you have any questions, by all means, hit up our support forums. I'm Shane from pdq.com. I'll talk to you later.